guys in this video I will show you my new fall handbag but before we get to it I just want to address why it's summer on my body and winter on my head <laughs> and that's because my hair is just not looking great today and I figured instead of struggling with it for like an hour trying to get it ready for the video I'll just put a hat on so that's what that is but anyway I wanted to show you a new handbag that I got that I wanted for years for like two and a half years i think i don't remember exactly when they came out but as soon as i saw them i wanted one and i just never could justify the price of them but um i was just waiting to see if they ever become available on nordstrom.com because i had some store credit i got the nordstrom notes whenever you make a purchase you accumulate points and then you get like the notes um so i had a bunch of those i had a gift card finally they became available on nordstrom and I just had to get it. And the bag that I'm talking about is a Gucci little crossbody. And I am so in love with this bag, I can't even tell you. And I know it's a ridiculous purchase, but if you're watching this video, you probably like designer handbags too, so you won't judge me, right? Um, I don't like unboxing videos, so I didn't wanna make one with this bag because I just think, why would you wanna see me open a box i'll just show you the actual bag and there it is it's so beautiful i cannot even tell you how happy i am that i got it i wore it a bunch of times already and i will basically just kind of go over the handbag tell you what fits in there what i think about it so far i've had it for about a month or so now and i did show little pieces of it in uh, my snapchat and instagram but I never really talked about it or addressed it or anything. Um, I did get some messages on Snapchat from some of you that have noticed that asked me questions about it. But um, so the bag, this is the Mini Marmont 2.0 uh, Velvet in black. And it's kind of hard to tell, but there's, oh, there it is. There's stitching on the bag. Um, so there's like white, is it white? It's black, but it kind of looks white on the camera. The actual stitching. It's got the CoverGirl <laughs> logo. I always think of CoverGirl. And the back is just, it's got a heart. And that's my favorite part. I know I'm like super bright right now, but it's because the camera is focusing on the actual bag. But I just love this heart. I think it's such a nice touch. And the hardware is gold and it's really heavy duty. And you can tell that it's just very well made. It doesn't feel like a cheap chain, you know? It feels like. You can throw it around and it'll be okay, which I will never do. And then it's got this leather part here on the strap. And um, I'll show you how it fits on me, actually, even though I'm wearing sweatpants. But so it fits this high. Um, I am five foot ten. So for me to wear a crossbody, it sits right here on my hip. So it's a little short. I prefer to just wear it on my shoulder. This is the mini and the mini is I believe eight inches wide and the way that you open it which was a little tricky to me at first I was like trying to open it but like it won't open it's broken but the trick to it is there's a little thing here that you press and that's how you open it and the inside is so beautiful it's got pink silk in there like how nice is that um, and it just says Gucci on here got the little pocket where I usually keep either like a lip gloss lipstick something that could possibly open and get all over the bag I keep it in here just to keep it extra secure and there's that much room and I have to tell you I wore this yesterday to a housewarming party and I had my iPhone 7 plus um, my car keys with which is like the remote with the Louis Vuitton card case I had a chapstick lipstick lip liner, um, tampons, and hand cream in here. And it fit fine, like there was a lot of room left over. So even though it's small, I feel like it's one of, it fits more than my other bags that are, my other mini bags that appear to be a little bit bigger, but they fit a lot less than this one does. So I think it fits a lot. Um, it's mini, but it's not super small. And it's made of velvet, which is really nice for fall. I think it's just like really, I don't know, it just puts you in this like festive mood. I feel like velvet clothes and velvet like shoes and handbags, they're just so folly, fall like. They just always put me in the holiday spirit and like the Thanksgiving state of mind. I actually thought that 
velvet would be really easy to take care of I thought that you could just like throw it around and nothing would ever happen and then that turned out to be false um, you do have to take care of velvet you have to be careful with um, like the chain can leave an imprint on the velvet so when I store it in my um, dust bag what I do is I kept this little thing that was that the bag was wrapped in and I keep this in between the chain and the handbag so when I store it I store it like this so that the chain doesn't leave an imprint on the bag I wore it three times now and I haven't had any problems I was going to actually take it to Spain with me but I figured you know what I'm packing in a carry-on everything's gonna be like super stuffed and so I don't want to take the risk of damaging it it seems sturdy so far and I was originally going to get this one in the fuchsia color which is the color that I wanted for the past like two years and I ended up getting the Philip Lim Pashley in a fuchsia color and I just thought that I don't need too many fuchsia handbags and so I got the black one which goes with like everything and I really really love it I just wanted to show it to you guys because I have gotten some questions on it and um, I mean I'm not sure what else to tell you about it it is expensive but to me designer handbags I've never had anything Gucci before um, except for perfume and so I think that a lot of designer handbags you can resell and you get more money than you paid sometimes you know these get sold out so fast I was stalking Nordstrom I would type in Gucci Marmont uh, handbag into the search bar like five times a day I'm not even kidding and I would stalk the website so much and as soon as I saw this I ordered it and like within an hour I told my friend about it she went to look it up and it was sold out already they get sold out so fast they also have the medium size um, which is also really nice but I wanted like a mini bag you know that I could take to weddings and, and stuff like that that I could just carry to like special events that's small um, and they also have these in a teal color and they have this really rich blue as well it's kind of like my tank top sort of shade of blue and I just think that it's a good investment and if I ever don't love it which I don't see myself selling this ever but if I ever do decide I don't like it anymore I could sell it and probably get most of my money back if not all if not all of it or even more um, especially that I did have some store credit and gift cards and stuff to use towards this and um, what else so I don't know I just I really love it I wanted to treat myself I think I'll wear it all the time and when we went to the house party yesterday um, all the women there were actually like three other Gucci bags there everyone put their handbags on the table and I'm like I didn't really want to leave it and like everyone gave me compliments on it men and women too so everyone notices how pretty this is I've always wanted a velvet handbag and I actually had my eye on um, just like no brand ones that you can get at like Marshalls I just you know looked around and I figured you know what I'm going to wear it so much I've wanted it for two years and that was my excuse for purchasing it um, but yeah they get sold out super fast and I didn't think that they'll come back this year because all through like since the beginning of this year I've been like stalking websites and pretty much every single website was sold out so I didn't know that they'll come back but I have seen them now that fall started I've seen them on Neyman Marcus, uh, Bird Goff, Goodman and um, Nordstrom and Saks too so I will link it if I can find it I'll link the other uh, the other color that I was looking into as well the fuchsia one maybe one day I'll get it um, I do get always nervous when I love a handbag I always get scared that it'll get like sold out and I'll never see it again and I don't like to buy pre-owned ones just because a lot of times the websites will sell them for like a hundred dollars less than you get them in the store so I'd rather just pay a little bit more and make sure that I get it in the store it's real and everything but yeah so that's my little my little reveal of my handbag if you have any questions just ask me below um, I really can't think of like what else to tell you Nordstrom has a really good return policy too so if you ever want to get it and you're not sure like if you don't have a Nordstrom near you or any stores that carries these you can always send it back so they have a good policy but um, yeah ask me any questions below and thank you for watching I'll see you soon bye